Hello, Justin. Uh, my name is Arpi Vartanian. I'm the Regional Director for the Armenian Assembly of America, and I'm here today with Justin Tremonti, who is one of our Armenian Assembly of America 2018 Summer Internship Program interns in Armenia. Justin has, this is his first visit, and he has been working at the Madena Daran uh, this summer, and so I wanted to talk with him a little bit and kind of get a sense of what he's thinking about Armenia and the program and his internship and whatever else he might want to add. So, Justin, I have to say that I'm really happy that you're one of our interns this year. Um, everyone, I have to say, everyone that I've met and who knows you is really impressed and rightfully so. Um, so let's talk about first, it's your first trip to Armenia. I don't know what you expected before you came here. Uh, maybe you can tell us a little bit about that. And has Armenia lived up to your expectations? Yeah, I would definitely say it's lived up to my expectations. It's definitely kind of changed them uh, a great deal. Um, I guess it's hard to tell because I was kind of such a, like a blank slate uh, coming here, um, having never really, obviously never been to Armenia, but also I didn't learn the language growing up. Um, I was a little bit more removed from the culture, uh, at least because my extended family kind of lived uh, one state away. Um, mm -hmm. So I think coming here, I was kind of just open to new experiences. I was kind of looking forward to just absorbing the culture as much as I can. And it was definitely dif difficult at first, um, but I think as the program's kind of winding down now, I feel like I'm you know, getting in the hang of it. So definitely, I'll want to come back at some point. That's, out that's outstanding. That's, yeah. I'm really happy to hear that. Um, so what, uh, you work at the Matanagara, Ancient yeah. Manuscript Repository. What do you do there? Um, so essentially I'm in two different departments. Uh, one is in the International Relations Department, um, where basically uh, I help out the um, analysts uh, basically organize conferences, uh, talks. Um, there's a UNESCO conference uh, about protecting cultural heritage in Syria. Um, so it's kind of... Uh, I sort of logistically assisted with them. Uh, I kind of helped out checking people into the uh, conference, sort of observed, uh, took notes. And uh, one thing that my, my skills as kind of a writer from school uh, sort of came in handy, I was able to kind of edit uh, their English language texts, um, speeches that some of the officials gave at the conference. Um, and currently right now in that department, I'm also helping them edit a brochure for the Matanadaran, um, sort of appealing to tourists. Um, sort of helping to make the uh, English section of the brochure um, kind of sound natural and attractive to people who might want to visit the museum. You know, some people might not realize how super important that is, so I thank you for that because right. uh, tourists really do need to, to read something that they understand and is clear and concise and explains all that, so bravo. Um, I can't wait to see the finished product. Um, we'll see. So now you've been touring around, in addition to the internship that you have, you've also had the opportunity through the program to tour around on various excursions and visit places like Gyumri last weekend, Haraba, Artsakh a few weeks ago, places within Yerevan, places outside of Yerevan, but within Armenia. Um, can you tell us a little bit about that and perhaps what was your favorite site or visit? Yeah, I mean like seeing the country has been amazing like i think it's absolutely essential to like get outside of yerevan and see different cities different places in the country um and it always amazes me how armenia is such a small country but like just the variety of different locations different like landscapes just just everything it's mm -hmm. just always amazes me um just from uh artsakh to gumri like <laughs> everything's different uh, yeah the people yeah. are different the culture is different um so I feel like it was definitely busy. Like every weekend we got to see something new, we got to experience something new. Um, and But even then it feels like I've only kind of just scratched the surface of kind of what's here. Very true, very true. You're gonna have to come back many, many more times right. to see everything. Um, okay, was there a favorite spot that you had? Um, I have to say, I mean, the whole trip to Artsakh was probably my favorite, um, specifically at Tatev Monastery, mm. probably. <laughs> has to be my favorite. Just it was so isolated, it was so remote and like secluded. It was the perfect time of day too. It was like the kind of sun was setting, it was very peaceful there. Ah, yeah. So I like that a lot. Yeah, nice. Okay. 
So tell me, what made you decide to come to Armenia and what made you decide to select to do an internship and an internship through the Armenian Assembly? Um, so, like I said before, um, I've always kind of been a little bit removed from my Armenian heritage. Um, so I feel like this was a great opportunity to kind of connect with it a bit more, um, sort of you know, get in touch with my roots, I guess, to be cliche. Um, yeah, so I think I, I've always been like interested by Armenian history and culture. Um, I studied history uh, undergraduate and um, I ended up writing a couple longer papers on the Armenian genocide, kind of dealing with the historiography of that topic, uh, delving deeply into it. Um, and I kind of got good feedback on those papers and I sort of used that as kind of an opportunity to maybe like come to the realization that I wanted to go to Armenia, um, kind of learn more about the culture firsthand. Uh, and of course, being in the Montenadaran, such an important kind of historical cultural institution, just kind of being fully uh, immersed in that. Outstanding. Okay, so what advice would you give to somebody who, like you, might be planning an internship to Armenia next summer? Um, definitely this program is worth uh, checking out. It's um, basically you kind of get like the best of everything. You get kind of autonomy, um, you get to sort of pursue your own uh, career goals and interests through the internship, uh, wherever they kind of set you up, and obviously you have a choice in that. Um, and also on the weekends you get to basically experience Armenia like a vacation almost. Uh, yeah. Just kind of, yeah, live it up basically. <laughs> and while also kind of experiencing the amazing things this country has to offer. Um, yeah, okay, all right. Um, well, Justin, thank you so much. I look forward you. to uh, spending the rest of the summer with you and also seeing you again in Armenia sometime soon. So thank you so much for your time. I hope it lives up to all of your your hopes and it becomes one of those lifelong memories for you. Thank you. Okay. Ciao.